Some of us have to work with idiots. Some of us are idiots who work with idiots. And here's a video of all the different varieties of idiots. Yes, sweetie. When old technology meets new technology, clamp versus Tesla. How to completely ruin a meal and your spine. This guy clearly took his driving test at the scrap metal yard. Maybe don't trust this company to build your new house. <laughs> These two have a profound misunderstanding of how elevators work. Wow, this cop is about to do something really cool. And wet. When a snowplow guy breaks through the fence, he has plenty of material to cover up the crime. Always take the pins out of a new shirt. Could this be the truck driver's fault or the person who designed the truck? this isn't this woman's very first time right pumping time. gas ever, then she probably needs to seek some kind of psychiatric help. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Oh! Yes, yes. Okay, she has it. She literally had an encircled around. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's judging her so hardcore. Is it the worker? Yeah. yeah. Yes! This driver is either trying to release his truck or just taking his frustration out on the nearest object. Here's how professionals demolish a chimney and give you a free skylight. Here's a quick tip from Akimbo. Heavy vehicles and mud just don't mix. Fear of heights? Well, don't watch this. No family car has ever been designed to take 600 kilograms of cement. You've heard of river dance? Well, here's car wash dance. At waitress training school, this is the exact face you're told to make when you drop the onion rings. This just can't be the official way to stack cars. Is there an official way to stack cars? When you think a car's about to hit you, and then you realize it's your car. This wood has been raised in captivity, but it's now being released back into the forest. If you set fire to wasps, then they'll take an instant <laughs> dislike to you. <laughs> The first rule of towing a trailer is that it shouldn't be disappearing into the distance when you look behind your tractor. You know those chocolate fountains? Well, this is the same, but uh, with oil. liquid cement is supposed to be, well, liquid? Well, here's something that's gone terribly wrong. Here's a subtle yet painful way to tell someone to stop lounging about on the job. Twice. Sometimes a car is so attractive, you just have to see it naked. Remember the guys driving the truck full of bricks? Well, this might just be them. Part construction video, part comedy routine. Here's someone who clearly enjoys pranking his colleagues. And himself. Are any of these bricklayers we've seen so far actually using mortar? 
when you accidentally drive over Superman's back of steel. As we all know, the best thing to do with delicate ceramics is to smash them with a hammer. When pirates made people walk the plank, it was never as funny as this. That touching moment when your colleague makes you a refreshing cup of magma. It's important to stay hydrated at work, even if you're a PC. This customer asked for an oil change, but ended up with an everything change. The funniest thing about this is how the other guy just looks at him and drives away. This is what happens when you go drag racing with your tractor. There's no use crying over spilled milk, but you've still got to clean it up. Jesus was a carpenter, but we're pretty sure he didn't mess with his co-workers like this guy does. Baggage handlers, delicately caring for your possessions 24 hours a day. This must be one of those submarine tractors we've heard so much about. Yes, Miri. Aí ficou bom. Ficou bom demais agora. Watch the skill, precision, and patience this worker shows cutting out this glass circle and then completely messing it up. If you want your hair to look like a collection of crop circles, then go see this guy. Hello, Something tells us this isn't the official way to unload a truck. When the machine pouring your concrete has had a really hot curry the night before. Have these guys ever heard of a ladder? Good manners cost nothing. As this construction worker found out. When your dad teaches you the correct technique to paint the neighbor's house blue. Frozen windscreen, hot coffee, yeah, just don't. This is how we did health and safety back in the good old days. A successful demolition of both the building and the driver's self-respect. an ingenious way to get yourself out of the mud and make things so much worse. This machine is drunk. It's the only explanation. If you take away part of a tree, then the tree might take away part of your dignity. Here's some inspiring footage of a cat being returned to the wild. No, not that kind of cat. A vital part of any chef's training is learning how to prepare a deep-fried iPhone. This is the security guy you want if there's a bomb in your underwear. When you drive your forklift so fast that you end up saying something that sounds like fork. When smug turns to smog. You definitely wouldn't want this guy to deliver your car or even to drive his own truck.
This man is clearly an expert in the water industry. <laughs> Even pieces of construction equipment can get dizzy. Here's someone who's had an easy day at work after locking himself inside this thing at the start of his shift and being discovered several hours later. <laughs> People pay a lot of money for glass with that completely shattered effect. You know the way a horse poops as it walks along the road? Well, this is the same thing, but with a concrete truck. How not to have a relaxing beer on the job. We're gonna go out on a limb and say that this wasn't built by professional engineers. When you're trying to do your job, but then you see two bloodthirsty hounds from hell running towards you. And that was his first and last day on the job. When things like this happen, the only answer is beer. The real question is, why is this guy chained up? It can't be because he's employee of the month. Yeah, it's okay. Give me this. this shoplifter is clearly a lot like Doctor Who's TARDIS. She's much bigger on the inside. When you need a helping hand. Literally. Sometimes, a highly venomous reptile turns out to be something that really complements your wardrobe. Okay, so what's this robot's actual job? And is it doing it right or wrong? Everyone needs a hobby. Even at work. Is he gonna make it? Is he gonna make it? Yes, he is. But he almost didn't. It's one of the oldest traditions in employment history. Pranking the apprentice. <laughs> You're never gonna get the hold of that, Left it. Sit down if you want. This is what happens when you snooze on the job. Yes, this woman actually thinks she's cleaning her car. Good job she didn't light a cigarette to celebrate. Have you seen those bumper stickers that say, Jesus is my co-pilot? Well, this is his donkey. Whether you're watching this at work or at home, don't forget to be the least idiotic person in the building by clicking subscribe.